Hey, this is James from Warrior Network. And in this video, we're gonna answer a question from a YouTube viewer. And that is about detoxing. So this video is going to be about detoxing your body from poisonous substances. Now you also mentioned in this comment that you had taken something and allowed yourself to take something into your body. We're not gonna discuss what it is, but what we're gonna say is why the fuck did you do that? Probably because you were told to do it by someone on the television. And this really fucks me off. The television, look, look, let's just talk about this for a second. The television, the television is a programming device, pure and simple. You can do the research into this. It is a programming device and it's designed to put you into a susceptible state. Anything, yeah, you could, it literally puts you into a hypnotic state. You can do the research into the rate that it flickers at and as you watch it and you sit there, you sink into a hypnotic state and at that point, you are very, very susceptible to being programmed subliminally. This is dangerous shit, very dangerous stuff. It controls the way that you act and the way that you think, which will control the outcome of your life. Do the research, that's all we can talk about on this channel, is just do the research into a television and also all the stuff that you watch. It is designed, and think about it, all the soap operas, all the films, all the documentaries, and all this stuff, it is designed to literally craft and design the way that you think. We'll leave it there. If you have taken something into your body that is potentially toxic and poisonous, then the first thing to do is stop doing that. If someone has told you on a television to take something into your body, you should actually be thinking, fuck, I need to check this out because this is probably not going to be for my best interest. If you have done this and you want to detox for any other reason, then what you do is you fast your fucking ass off. If you are fat, you follow the Warrior Network protocol, okay? You can fast easily. If you are lean, then you are going to have to fast for as long as you can comfortably before you refeed. The other thing that you can do is look into dry fasting. Dry fasting is very, very powerful and much more powerful than normal fasting for removing toxins from the body. The autophagy process is much stronger. Your body is literally going to be burning shit up inside you. So you can do the research into dry fasting and that will be a tool that you can use to help to reduce anything toxic that is in your body. Now, whether that's from food or anything else that you have been manipulated or allowed yourself to receive into your body, yeah? Dry fasting is the best thing that I can suggest. And the next best thing is don't ever fucking do that again, yeah? Don't ever allow yourself to accept something inside your body without first doing your own research. It is as simple as that. And that's all I'm gonna say on the matter. So, dry fasting. There's not much information on my channel about dry fasting because I haven't done much dry fasting myself, but here's some suggestions for you. Do the research on channels that do have someone that's done a lot of dry fasting. The longest dry fasting I've done is 44 hours. It is very, very powerful for detox. It is also very powerful for fat loss. And the other thing that you can do, and that I've kind of slipped into doing a lot myself recently, is kind of having a dry fasting protocol where you spend a certain proportion of the day without taking in anything at all. No food and no liquids. So maybe you could do something like maybe a 20 hour dry fast each day. And then what you can do is have an hour or two where you take in the electrolyte solution, which we talk about here on the channel. Do something like that, yeah? But get in as much dry fasting as possible. The more toxic, and the more worried you are about the toxin that you have taken in, you need to fast for longer. Do the longest dry fast that you can, okay? And don't ever do this shit again. Talk to you on the next video.